Why do I tell stories? <laughs> How many SD cards you got? <laughs> Well, I'm kind of a, a, a gearhead, right? Um, and I kind of had to unlearn that in doc class. I decided to apply for the documentary intensive class because I needed to fill in the disadvantages of having been self-taught. Because it's not, not necessarily always about the equipment or cameras that you're using, uh, or more so uh, about how the story is told, what the story is, the storyline itself. It's something that I'm interested in. I, I love politics, I love um, history, and it's something I'm interested in, so it just makes sense that I, I find joy in making the documentary films. First of all, it's designed so that you immediately have to depend upon your neighbors. You know, you're not alone in this. This is not a competition between individuals. You immediately turn to your neighbors. You are tasked to interview each other. You are tasked to explain your documentary to each other. Several things happened in the class. One was um, just historically looking at documentaries that have been made and um, analyzing them and showing work that we've done in the class and being critiqued by um, the fellow classmates. We spend a lot of time just hanging out. And it's not like we sit there and like we don't talk, we, but like a big part of it is like, it's actually, I used to be an English as a second language teacher. I have used a lot of my English as a second language teaching skills in the documentary class because when you teach English, the goal is to just get people talking, to build confidence. And instead of doing that here, of course, part of it is building confidence, but it's also just building camaraderie. I appreciated that, you know, it gave me an opportunity to see things from a, a perspective other than my own. When you locked in for a long period of time, I don't want to use that phrase, but when you in a, in a, you know, in a class with somebody, you get to know them, you know. Um, you get to know them intellectually, you get to know them personally, um, creatively, you know, um, and you get to pick their brains, you know, see how they actually think or make some tick. Probably because I have an immigrant like background that I just love the multiculturalness of it. Everything in this world is interconnected and somehow the diversity in this class, well, it's, I guess, bringing out the best in New York. Having to sit down and say, okay, I have to define this. I have to communicate what I am going to shoot what it's going to look like. For example, do, do I shoot it in the morning? Is that most suitable to my subject? Do I shoot it in the afternoon sun? Do I shoot it with lights in an interior studio? What helps the story along? That's part of it. So I think I'm pushing everyone in the direction of like, how can you make your film a stronger statement about you, even if you're not in your film. It's always a work in progress. Like you sometimes never know exactly when it's finished. Every class has just added layer and layer of new bits of information. And I could see the development and growth in everyone's work as the weeks went on. There is a common understanding of we don't know it all when you walk in the room. Like, and it's, it's cool, you know, you're not supposed to know it all. Doing a documentary, getting involved with a new skill will just add longevity to your life as well as keep your mind bright and alert. I got to sit front row on somebody else's life history and I don't have to travel very far. <laughs> what I believe that we're teaching at the end of the day, beyond the filmmaking skills and the tech, is like the, the, the ability to like critically think about the media that you see day in and day out. I think once people understand that and once they realize that they can make their own statements with media, it stops being a top-down tool. It stops being a tool of people that can say what they want to say and becomes much more about the people saying what's important to them. I'd do it again. That should say enough. <laughs>